Hi, everybody. All right. Hi, guys. Um, okay, let's see. I'll wait a little bit here, get some people to join. Had a little issue with the computer connecting to the camera. Cool. Looks like we're all going. Oh, hey, Corey. Good morning. <laughs> Hope you got your cats ready to lift. <laughs> Jump over. <laughs> Hey Liz, good morning. Yay, glad you made it. Um, I don't know if I can tell on Facebook like who logs in, but um, it's nice to see it on Instagram. Okay guys, so um, we'll see here if a couple other people join, they can always hop in. But while I've got you here, um, if you've got anything around, like a chair, um, table, couch, something like that, we're gonna be doing some Bulgarian um, split squats. So You'll be able to like run over. You don't have to adjust like your phone or anything. Run over and throw your leg up on that. So um, nothing crazy high. You can kind of see my box here. I'll move stuff so you can get it in screen when it needs to be. But um, yeah, so Bulgarian split, split squats, what we'll be doing later. So something about knee high or so. Um, so you can put your foot up on there. If you don't have anything around, like so it can be couch, table, anything, you can just do lunges when we get to that. So um, yeah, go ahead, make sure you got your water ready, um, start a playlist. I've got some music playing in the background, but I don't want it to be too loud that you guys, I don't know if you'll be able to hear it enough because I want you to be able to hear me. And um, it's a good time to just like play the music that is going to pump you up and get you through it, especially because we are alone here. So sometimes that's going to be what helps you, helps you most. So um, get that playlist going. We're going to start warming up. So we've got, we're going to start with some leg swings here. Move my box back out of the way. Leg swings just about 10 aside. Forward. Sherry's got her ankle it's on. Awesome. <laughs> Forward and back. Can we do it in lots of kind of lunge motions and stuff? So we want to get those hip flexors warmed up. Moving a little side to side in case we've just been moving forward and back by sitting up and down off of the couch. Now let's take it to the side. Side swings here might feel a little awkward, but just think about getting up high here. Getting that abduction in the hip. I'm holding on to my ceiling, so if you need to hold on to something. Okay, let's switch legs. Other side, let's see what can I hold on to. I'll turn balance forward and back. Make sure you got enough clearance and you're not going to kick said cats or dogs or whatever. I had enough, had a little warm up trying to carry my box up the stairs today. All right, let's go side to side. Awesome. Got some people joining. Beautiful. All right, from here, let's go ahead and. Uh, Take it into some just straight leg lifts. So I want you to balance for this one. So we're starting to work that standing leg, squeeze it up tight. Get a get my computer. Facebook is a little different. Okay. Um, so standing on one leg, other leg just out to the side. So try not to let that other hip, the standing leg, compensate by going out. You want that hip to be right over the leg. So maybe you're only lifting. Halfway, just lift as far as you can again without that other hip compensating out to the side. Flex the toe of that lifting leg. Squeeze that standing leg. Okay, just switch sides. I'm looking down, <laughs> looking down at the computer screen to see who just joined. Hi, Chris, good to see you. Okay, squeeze that standing leg. Belly in towards the spine. You can work that, work those abs here, engage them. Couple more. 
Awesome, give it a little shake out. Okay, let's go ahead and take it into a little jog in place. Apologize for anyone who might be below you sleeping. <laughs> Just a little bit here. Working on maybe getting those knees up a little higher. Moving those arms a little. We're going about 30 seconds here, so just keep it moving. Switch it to a little bit of a butt kicker, so heels to butt. Then we're just gonna go a little, little hop side to side. Move those hips a little, and keep moving the arms. And time there, all right. Gonna take it into some reverse lunges here. Front knee over that ankle, step it back, alternate legs. Get that back knee close to the floor. Remember you're dropping straight down in that lunge, like an elevator. Shoulder stay stacked over the hips. <laughs> Core in, engaged. A few more, let's bring the arms up overhead. Make sure you're not overarching in that spine, you're not here. Ribs in. Okay, go ahead, pause your lunge here, whatever side you're on, hold it. Just a steady hold, stack the knee over the ankle there, you should be able to see those toes. Hey Jen, <laughs> join in on Facebook, awesome. Again, you guys feel free at any time, type in a question if you have it. You know, it's hard to do, um, keep holding, but uh, I'll try and read them. I'm trying to watch and see if something new pops up, try to address it, especially if it's a question about how we're moving. All right, now from here, you're just going to drop the hands down and drop the back knee. So you're going to low lunge. Low lunge position, hands to the inside of that front foot, and you can either keep that knee down or lift that knee up and move a little forward. And back, and just really stretching out those hip flexors. A lot of us may have been sitting down this week, and maybe make little circles. Switch direction of that circle. Whatever movement feels good here, we're holding another 10 seconds. Press up through those shoulders, don't let yourself just sink into the floor, press into the floor. All right, come on up. So we're coming into that lunge, switch, switching sides, other leg forward. Again, that front knee over that ankle. Holding here, shoulders over the hips. Just a nice, steady, static hold. Ten more seconds here, drop a little lower if you can. <sighs> I did some legs yesterday, <laughs> bad move. Okay, coming down. Then you can drop that back knee, that low lunge position. Just moving and stretching that hip. Or that back knee is lifted, moving forward and back. So I'll show you from the side here, so just here. And press it away from the floor, not letting the chest drop. Maybe little circles, a few each way. 10 more seconds here. Okay, 
And go ahead, come on up. Okay, just a couple more things here. Just some squat jumps. Um, we're just going to do 10, and then we're going to get going in the little circuit we've got here today. So if you're not comfortable with squat hops, you can just lift those heels coming up tall or just squat 10. Here we go. Ready? One. Whew. All right. Shake it out. Okay, grab a slip if you need. I'll go over the first move here. Okay, we're going to do curtsy move here, a little curtsy to squat. About to get my playlist going. Okay, so you're going to take a curtsy on one side, squat in the middle, curtsy on the other side. So if you got any kind of weight, holding that weight just at the chest. I might be a little too aggressive for today. <laughs> um, if you don't have any weight, your option is going to be curtsy, squat, hop, curtsy. All right, guys. We're going in intervals, 45 seconds. Um, so get yourself set. Curtsy, squat, curtsy. Here we go. Three, two, one. Go for it. Curtsy, squat, Curtsy. Squatting in the middle each time. Keep going here. Just gonna switch my screen again. Okay. If you got a lightweight, you can still get that hop. Land with soft knees. to 20 second rest, especially in this first round, as I show you guys the next move. Okay, we're going to do a little shuffle and side hop here, so let's see here, I'll try and move my view back a little bit. Okay, so what we're going to do on one side, give a little shuffle, I'll give a yell when you hop, so it's shuffle those feet, hop, hop down to a burpee, shuffle those feet, hop, no push up at the bottom. I will tell you when to hop. So you just shuffle those feet until I say hop. Then you're hopping to the other side. Pop back to that burpee and right back up. Hey, Kelly, good to see you. <laughs> okay, guys, 45 seconds. Here we go. Shuffle those feet. Shuffle, 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 hop. Right back up and shuffling. Here I am. <laughs> hop, pop back. Shuffle, 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 fast feet. It don't have to go high, just fast. Hop. Shuffle. Get back and screen a little hop. Shuffle. Hop. Hop. Shuffle. Hop. 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 Time. Whew. Okay, rest. Whew, nice job, guys. Okay, um, so for this next one, we're going to be on the floor doing some bridges. Then we've got those Bulgarian squats. So I'll give you a second. If you missed it in the beginning, grab, uh, find something nearby. You can run to it as long as you can still hear me. Um, that you can put your foot up on, couch, bed, chair, table, anything. If you've got nothing around to elevate your foot, then um, you're just going to do lunges. So, bridges to start for on the floor. So you want those ankles right under those knees. If you've got weight, 
Leg on your hip crease there. Lifting up to a bridge. And one leg up. You're down. And up. No weight. That is fine. All right, guys. Bend that bridge. And here we go. One leg up. Really press through that grounded heel. Get that butt up as high as you can. Nice and controlled on the way down. Don't just flop yourself down. I did a shit ton of these yesterday too. Switching legs, other leg down. Remember, place, place it right under that knee. Turn it down a little. <laughs> I feel like you guys can't really hear me. Okay. Other side, lift up, and let's do it. Remember, if you've got no weight, you can just go for more reps. If you got some weight, slower, steadier. Only if it's challenging. If it's not challenging, try and get as many reps as possible. I got 24 pounds in this pack. So, yeah. <laughs> I still want to go split boarding possibly today too, Liz. Cherie, that applies to you too if you're down to go to back country. I don't know if you have school. Time. Awesome. Okay, awesome guys. <laughs> okay, come to that Bulgarian squat. So I'll show you real quick if you have to run out a screenshot what that looks like. So elevate it behind you. Pop that front foot as much as forward as much as you need to to make sure the knee stays behind the toe. Um, foot can be curled on the box or flat wherever you have the most stability. Maybe I'll do it from the side. Okay, guys. Round one. Okay. Get set. Here we go. Head up, side one. Ooh. I don't want it further enough back. Keep going, keep going if you're there. Keep that heel down. Core tight. Remember, slow and steady if you've got weight. Go for more reps if you don't have weight. Time. Quick rest here before we switch it out. Check in the comments real quick. Okay. Okay. Side two. Elevate it. Get set. Here we go. So pay attention to where that front foot is. Just an imaginary line, two feet hop over and back, 
side to side here, try to take off. Um, two feet and land with those two feet. Okay, here we go, four to five. Let's do it. Just a little hop. If you get too tired or you can't hop over your item, just hop behind it. Feel like I'm gonna bounce through the floor. <laughs> If any of you guys used to go to the body loft when I was upstairs, <laughs> it'd be so loud as we'd hop and slam. Last five. Time. All right. Rest. I'm trying to open my blinds, but it's a little too bright for that. Okay, we're going to a well sit. So, um, anything you can come up against. If you don't have a wall, uh, sit in a squat. Hold a low squat. 45, if you got that weight, hold it. I got one bladder here. It's about 13 pounds. Here we go. 90 degrees. Try to do it from the side. Can't really see too well. Um, back flat against the wall. Weight just resting on you, or you've got the option, hold it out, server's hold, or overhead. A few different options of progression there. Belly button in. We're gonna keep that 90. Knee should be right over the heels. 10 seconds. Time. Okay. Wait down. Come off the wall. All right. One more in our move here. So I'm trying to get in every plane of motion today. That's a. Uh, um, hi, Hillary. Good morning. <laughs> so every plane, frontal, sagittal, transverse. So we're going into the transverse, which means we're just adding a little rotation. Most of us have been in that sagittal plane, which means we're just sitting down and back up, not moving side to side. So that's why we got the hops. And uh, here we're going into a lunge, a balancing uh, cross balance lunge here. So step into a lunge, weight comes to the side of that bent leg. As you come up, weight comes up overhead, bring that knee up, step into your lunge, rotate. Okay, side one. Again, no weight's just fine. Still bring your arms up overhead. Watch the arching in the back when you come up overhead. All right, get set. Here we go. Set it back into your lunge. Drop that back knee. Slow up. Balance. Hips stacked right over the heel. Drop it. Lift it. Core in tight. Straight from the side. Right here. Come on up. Oh. Make sure you're getting some rotation in that twist and that front foot is staying facing forward. Time, okay, switching sides. Give it a little shake out, deep breath. Side two, just rotating the other way. Other leg stepping back. All right, get set. Here we go. Step back, drop it, come up, and press. I really wish I could see you guys right now. Remember, core stays tight. All joints stacked on top of each other as we're standing tall. Heels, hips, shoulders, one line, ears as well, right over those shoulders. The knee is not rotating, just the torso.
Time. Okay. All right, rest, guys. What about a minute of rest here? So grab water. Thanks, Sheree. Have fun. See you after. Um, yeah, grab a little water if you need it. Uh, make any adjustments as you need. Whether that's you thought of something all of a sudden in your mind that you can lift. <laughs> Change your music if you need. Um, move anything closer to that uh, box if you need to, if it's biting into your time. But we should have enough time that you can get to that for the Bulgarian squat. Also, too, yeah, any questions you have now, feel free. We've got a few, about 20 more seconds here, so. I don't know about you guys, but I'm like sweating like a pig already. I don't know if it's this room, <laughs> but it's, whatever, I'll take it. It makes me feel good. Glad you found us, Kelly. Sweating all over my notebook. <laughs> Okay, so we're doing that all again, guys. That was our circuit. We're going back from the top. So it's that curtsy, curtsy, squat, curtsy. Squat in the middle each time. Um, no matter if you got no weight, feel free to uh, <laughs> feel free to hop in the middle. All right, guys. Turning my music back up a little. Um, if it affects my voice, let me know. Okay, here we go. Curtsy, squat, curtsy. Okay, ready, set, get set, let's do it, curtsy, squat, curtsy, maybe you hop just once, alternate each time you hop, remember, I say this in class all the time, there's a lot of things between hardest and easiest, find your challenging middle ground, especially as we go on, we get to second and third rounds, you might have to adjust. That's just real. Doesn't mean you're weak. It means you actually worked hard in the first round. You should be like, oh, God, as we move on. Whew, especially hops. I haven't been doing enough hops. They're killing me. Time. Speaking of hops, we got our shuffle. Hop to that burpee. So remember, just hop when I say hop. I was trying to throw you guys up at the end there where we just hop, hop, hop. Shuffle those feet as soon as you get back up from that burpee. Okay, here we go. Get set, shuffle, hop. Shuffle those feet, hop. Real quick burpee back there. Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Hop. Hop. You can do a two foot hop or a little skater hop. 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 Shuffle. Hop. Shuffle it out. Time. My box kept getting in my way. <laughs> okay, guys. <laughs> um, we're down on the floor for those glute, glute bridges. <sighs> on your back. Remember, I'll keep repeating myself because I don't know who missed what or whatever. So, no weight, more rep. Weight, adjust the speed as needed. Down. Heels under the knees and lift into that bridge. One foot raised. Here we go. Press and that foot into the ground. Hips as high as you can. Squeeze it at the top. Control the lower. Back flat against the floor. <sighs> Fifteen seconds, guys. Keep getting up there. Time. Switch. 
shake that knee that was bent out if it needs to be. Okay, side two. Good set, here we go. And we're trying not to let that chin tuck as we do these. Airway stays open. Shoulders flat against the floor. Trying to limit the wobble in that bent knee. Five seconds, guys. A couple more. Time. Well, you don't like the bridges, Corey? Okay, um, Bulgarian squats, guys. Kind of super setting these single leg moves. Trying to get that butt and those hamstrings working. So get to your elevated spot. Foot up. Okay, here we go. Get set. Oh, wait. Okay, no, that's right. <laughs> Now we skipped our lateral hop. Let's next. Okay, get set. Go. Here we go. Time's on. As low as you can get down without losing that form. Keep that core engaged here. Oh, yeah, ten seconds. Oh, time. Holy oh, shit. Side two. Slow down. Really, I just start my time with balancing this thing on my back. Okay, elevate that foot. Here we go. Second side, go for it. Squeeze that back glute. Remember, speed comes after the quality. Your knee is wobbly, shaky. Losing your balance, you slow it down. Straight down, straight up. Weight towards the back of the foot. Time. Okay. Pops. I also did these yesterday. Ooh, what a thinker. <laughs> Make my hop a little shorter here. Um, smaller it is, let's go for faster. All right. Hi, Johnny. <laughs> okay, here we go. Get set. Two foot land and take off together. Go. Whoops. like the hops. <laughs> okay, floss it. Time to slow it down. Should be harder if you're out of breath. Okay, get up against it. 
or that squat hold. Okay, toes on. Should be in your position. Ninety degrees. Knees to hips. Use this time to breathe in through the nose, out through the nose or mouth. Slow and steady. Ten seconds. Time. Whew. Okay, guys. One more in this circuit, then we get a rest. Um, our lunges with a chop. I tried to do my hair today. I can't tell, but it's a braid. <laughs> okay. Grab that weight if you got it. Reverse lunge with that balance. Chop into the side. Rotation. Okay, get set. Here we go. Step back, remember just straight back down in your lunge, up to that balance. Switch my view here. Keep going, you guys. Just gotta adjust my camera. Remember, don't let that front knee rotate. Squeeze the standing leg. Switch it. Side two. Get set. And here we go. Stepping into that lunge. Whole foot on the ground. I often go to my pinky edge, keep the big toe pressing into the floor as you come to that balance. Last ten. here. Pause my music for a second while we take this break. Um, so again, time for questions if you have them. Uh, last round here. Let's see. I don't want to go over time too much, even though we all might be stuck at home. Uh, what we're going to do is do the next round by reps. So 10 each or total. I'll tell you with um, the exercise if it's going to be 10 aside or 10 total. Um, mostly for like the hops and stuff, it'll just be 10 total. Whew. So glad you guys made it this morning. Again, I'll be hanging on here for a minute afterwards. Um, if there's any questions, input comments, and remember to um, you can always send me a message later if you thought of something or definitely to tell me like what you want to look for in um in class next week assuming we're here again next week i kind of think we will be i haven't heard anything for sure but just with more things keep shutting down i think we're gonna be in for it for at, at least one more week but let's keep that motivation up all right i hope that this is helping you guys um, you know, I feel like the hardest part is getting out of bed, but I got up, brushed my teeth, got dressed in my hair, <laughs> like I was like going to the gym, so it helps. So do that same thing. All right, guys. Okay, let's get going. Let's get ready for the second or last set. So like I said, we're going to do reps. So um, I apologize since I can't see you guys if uh, 
we get way off track or anything, if you're ahead of us, great. You can wait to start the next or keep going. If you're behind us, please finish your um, finish your, your set, even if we've moved on to the next. Get your 10 in. On Facebook, if, uh, you'll be able to rewatch later. You can't pause a lot. So, okay. Here we go. We're going um, 10 total for the curtsy with the hop. So we'll count the curtsy. So oh, let me start my music here. Sorry. Okay. All right. Here we go with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, moving on, our shuffle hop. So what we're gonna do is just uh, let go of the shuffle and just a hop to that burpee. So your hops count two feet together or a single hop like a skater, okay? One, two, three, four, Five, six, I think I lost count, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, glute bridge is next. Ten each leg. Position, leg up, first side, lifts up, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switch it out, lift up, drop down, one, two, Three, I'm counting at the bottom, by the way. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Coming up, Bulgarian squats. Boom, by faster here. Whew. But I'm moving slower. <laughs> okay. Get set. Leg up. Side one. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Put up, side two, here we go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, all right. Hops, two foot, ten total. Ten total. One, two, three, four. Every time your feet hit the ground, it's one. Here we go, get set, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That one's a lot easier with just doing ten. Wall set. Okay. Here's the deal with the wall sit. We're adding a leg extension. So you're gonna sit, alternating a leg extension there. 10 total. Okay, get in your wall sit, 90. And lift up, extend, one, two. Try not to wiggle too much in the upper body. Three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Okay, I thought I forgot our burpees. <laughs> okay, our lunge drop. Last one, guys. Ten each side. Okay. Here we go. Finish strong. All right. Here we go. Sit it back. Balance. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Side two. Take a breath. Here we go. One. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. Breathe. Uh, walk it out. Hang with me for just a sec here. I'll address a couple things. Uh, and oh, hands over the head if you need it. Just giving those legs a little kick out. Drink some water. Try to drink it controllably. Not chug it. <laughs> Even though that's all I ever want to do after is just chug. So, uh, as we're having a little chat here, stretch, quad stretch, hamstrings, um, it's your chance here to do what feels best for your body, um, any position, anything that needs it most. So, I'm, uh, bring your forwards here. That'll feel nice in the butt after the bridges and squats and hops. Um, inside thigh, yeah, adductor stuff. You know, I did have side lunges in my mind this morning, and then I got caught up with curtsies um, to go with like the, the glutes of the Bulgarian squats and um, bridges. But I'll definitely, definitely do that because we're still out there skiing, hopefully, um, and maybe even a little, a little more side stepping and things like that. <laughs> As we're in the back country, I don't know if they're still grooming at the cross-country places, Tahoe Donner and anything like that. I'm not sure what those statuses are, if they're closed, if anyone's skate skiing. But yeah, my inner thighs killed me after the one and only time I've <laughs> I skate skied. It, skied. Um, so yeah, again, feel free to think of um, something this weekend or anything. Feel free to shoot any ideas my way, um, especially for the upper body. I love legs. I uh, feel like it comes easier to me, especially for at-home work, because Arms for me are just hard to do with um, just body weight stuff. You know, it's lots of push-ups and things like that. And I know for a lot of people, um, that can be a lot on their wrists. So I want to definitely think of some things that we can use and do that are involving other other muscles. We're not on the um, on a wrist the whole class, but if you can this weekend, grab some grab some stuff. Couple. Like up here at dumbbells, you can always double up the dumbbells to do bicep curls or if you need them heavier weights or anything. And if you guys did watch my little IGTV thing, it was just 15 minutes long. I just talked about the equipment that I have at home and use that makes it super easy, like my little backpack I've been using and uh, TRX, of course. Um, so I like this backpack, and you know, you can do bicep curls, triceps, and you can go from like sub zero to 60 pounds. You can fill the reservoirs with either sand or water. 
the stand, you get 15 pounds of water. I weigh them, I get about 13 and a half per reservoir, just like this. So they look like four fit in this pack. But anyways, I want to keep you guys, keep stretching. Thank you so much for uh, joining me this morning. Hope you guys got sweaty like me. And uh, I'll see you guys soon, okay? Send me any messages. Thanks so much. Have a great day.